Do you get to be like a normal high schooler at all? <laughs> I mean, that. No, nah, not really. Everybody views you as just a basketball player. Like I just sometimes I want to just be viewed as a regular, like a regular person. Like I'm still, I'm still the same dude that you are. Like I still do the same regular stuff that you do on a daily basis. I just play basketball at a high level. He's always been very competitive. I mean, yeah. in anything, I mean, since he was little, I mean, he had to be the first one to the bus stop. <laughs> you know, you had to read a book, he was gonna be the first one. And, you know, he's always playing with his brothers. He didn't like to lose. I mean, he's just, he's always been like that. Like, he was always just itching to play something. In third grade, he started playing uh, organized basketball, AAU team with um, Coach Bushrod called Leesburg Basketball Club. And he played from third grade to about seventh grade. We just progressed and progressed and eventually got to like the national level and started playing like out of state and just going here every weekend. We were playing like 80 games in a whole like a whole year. So we were like just playing a lot. And then probably my seventh, eighth grade year is when I really thought I could I could take it to the next level. And then I made my decision to come to PVI and uh, it's the best decision I made. He fits right in with so many of our students and gets along well with them. And uh, you know, they're all just they're all just 14, 18 year olds trying to trying to achieve and be successful and, and, and be good human beings. And Jeremy kind of fits that. And I think that's one of the things that's beautiful about PVI is just that family atmosphere. The kids all lift each other up and support each other. I think it's it's fun to watch uh, Jeremy uh, just interact with everybody. And uh, he, he just acts like any other you know 17, 18 year old. When you know uh, you're, you're good enough to play at Duke, you are uh, talented, but you also have character. Um, you also have to be an ac excellent student. Um, you have to be humble. Um, you understand that you're part of something bigger than yourself. Uh, it's just high expectations, so you have to be able to handle that and handle it with grace. And I think that, uh, so when Coach K you know, called me originally and, and, and talked about how much he appreciated Jeremy and he described his game and what he liked about him and, and saw his ability, I really appreciated um, that he saw all the intangibles that we talked about and uh, not just his play on the court. I never thought I'd be in this position to go into Duke, playing for Coach K, playing for the, for the for the fans down in Durham. Like I just never, I just never thought of that. But it just feels so surreal right now. I was gonna say, do you think that has that even sunk in? Do you think the reality of that? <laughs> I mean, it has, but like it hasn't. All, it hasn't got all the way there because everybody's like, "Oh, you're going to Duke, you're going to Duke." I'm like, "Yeah, like I'm going to Duke." Like, I I just don't want to be too big headed, but like I should I just take it all in.